Hey guys, it's your girl Miss T. You know that's me and I'm back at it with another NXT recap. This time we're talking NXT Spring Breakin'. But before anything, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe and let's jump into this one. First things first, we need to talk about the triple threat between Lyra Valkyria, Tatum Paxley, and Roxanne Perez. As you see, Tatum Paxley totally killed it. These women opened up the show in the perfect way, but you already know how this one ended. Miss Roxanne Perez has retained. Overall, the match was really good. Roxanne Perez did her thing and snuck in the win, but I gotta tell you, I got my eye on Tatum Paxley because she is a star in the making. So on tonight's episode of NXT, so many main roster superstars made their appearances from Damian Priest, Shayna Baszler, as you see here, Pete Dunne, Tyler Bate, and so much more. But this segment right here was so freaking cool. I was happy to see Shayna Baszler come and support Lola Vice. This was the contract signing next week on NXT Spring Breaking Week 2 is when the actual match is going to happen for NXT Underground. Natty is doing a great Great job as a veteran trying to elevate Lola Vice. Lola Vice was looking amazing. She was spicy. She was fantastic. You already know Latina Heat. She got it. And Carmen also did great by doing a super kick on Shayna Baszler. The whole segment was really good. I am so looking forward to this match. Oh my God. One of my favorite matches of the night was Sol Ruka versus Blair Davenport. Both of these women put on an amazing performance. But there were so many stunts in this match. There was a lot of props being used. Super creative match. Must see if you missed the show. Go back and watch this one. As you see, they went through the picnic table. Sol Ruka is back in full effect. And I love this for her. But I'm also looking at what's next for Blair Davenport. I'm looking forward to seeing where both of these women go. I'm hoping they go after that North American title as being introduced for the women. So as I told you, there were so many main roster wrestlers that made an appearance on NXT and Johnny Wrestling was one of them. It was pretty cool to see him talking to Trick Williams, preparing Trick for his opportunity and for his big match. What might have been Baron Corbin's last match on NXT, it finished in a Lexus King victory. And let me tell you, this was a solid match. I like that Corbin put over Lexus King in what could have been his last NXT match. Corbin is rumored to continue his tag team with Braun Breaker now that Braun Breaker is on the main roster. This was solid. This was great veteran work from Corbin's end. And I love this for Lexus King. Hopefully we can get the ball rolling and maybe go after that North American title, even though Obafemi is not looking to cough it up anytime soon. As I mentioned before, Damian Priest and so many other main roster superstars appeared on tonight's episode of NXT. And Damian Priest just kind of gave Ilya Dragunov the nod and the good luck to your match. This is what everybody is talking about is the main event of NXT Spring Break in week one. Trick Williams versus Ilya Dragunov. This was a straight up banger. And what a way for Ilya Dragunov to just pretty much have what could potentially be his last match in NXT. He had a great performance. Trick Williams looked amazing out there. This to me was an 11 out of 10 match. Absolutely loved it from start to finish. There was a lot of great stunts and you already know it was brutal. No, seriously, it was freaking brutal. Take a look at this. Going through the table, Trick Williams had to go over the top to try to slay the mad dragon, and he did just that. And in the end, this is what it resulted to. Trick Williams is now your new NXT champion, and I cannot wait to see this next chapter unfold for NXT. We are watching history before our eyes. That generation, the tail end of the black and gold NXT 2.0 is pretty much closing from Braun Breaker, Carmelo Hayes, Dragunov. These guys are going to be pushed up to the main roster. We have the WWE draft this Friday. You already know it is time for the whoop that trick era here in NXT. And there's so much young talent flourishing as we say bye to some of our favorites and i wish him well on the main roster i'm so excited for this and i'm so happy for trick because he totally deserves it this match was ideal for him ideal for dragon off 
And in the end, they share this awesome moment. Ilya Dragunov, such a class act. This guy is passionate and it shows. And he just passed the torch to Trick Williams. What better way to go out? We already know he declared for the WWE draft officially when he made his first appearance on Monday Night Raw. I can't wait to see Ilya Dragunov on the main roster. I'm hoping we get to see him versus Gunther again. Uh, if you didn't see their first go, please go back and watch that. But this was so freaking awesome. And I'm just so happy for Trick Williams. In other WWE news, Cameron Grimes has announced that he has officially been released by WWE. This is such unfortunate news and super disappointing, but here's what he had to say. This is Trevor Lee, also known as Cameron Grimes. I just got off the phone with WWE and unfortunately I've been released from my contract. Five years ago, the last thing that I was able to tell my father, Tracy Cadell, was that I signed with the WWE. I loved working here. I loved working at the WWE. I want to thank absolutely everybody that's helped me. I could sit here and name off a list of people, but the video might be a little bit too long. Even though you guys haven't seen me in the past year, I've been trying my best to learn from everybody that comes through, everybody that would let me sit there and listen. But if you're a fan of mine, I'm here to let you know that there's a damn fire lit under my ass, man. All I want to do is work. All I've ever wanted to do is work. This is all I got, man. But hey, the good news is there ain't going to be no stopping Trevor Lee now, baby. Let me tell you that. I love you guys. If you're watching this, I love you. We're going to figure this out. This isn't what I wanted to do at all. The WWE is all I've ever wanted to do and be. But if I have to go somewhere else now to show them that they missed out, I guess that's what I got to do. Thank you, guys. So let me know what you guys thought about NXT Spring Breaking. Are you ready for week two? All this news on Cameron Grimes. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments. Before anything, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe so you can stay up to date with all the episodes, the recaps, and so much more. You already know. Until next time, uh, deuces.